This is a lesson number eight, which is e-commerce, and we will learn about uh, electronic data internet change, that is EDI. Then, what is e-commerce, and what are e-greetings? What are the influence on user as far as e-commerce is concerned, and what factor one should keep in mind while we are doing e-commerce? The websites. We'll take examples also. e-commerce e is what electronic commerce we know so let us start with edi electronic data interchange so this edi is an electronic communication method where we use the digital media to provide standards for exchanging data via any electronic means now we have company 1 or say organization one we have company two they may be in different countries they can electronically exchange say documents like the purchase orders the invoices the shipping notices and many more so this edi electronic data interchange this implies messages or sequence of messages between these two parties c1 can be the originator C2 can be the recipient or vice versa. The data which is uh, formatted is transmitted via network that is telecommunication or they may be physically transported on the electronic storage media. We can use wires. So what is e-commerce and e-greeting? E-commerce doing commerce using electronic or electronics we are talking about the transaction or exchange any form of transaction or exchange where electronic media is being employed or is being used and this is done to facilitate the transaction what are the e business social impacts that is when e business has come into being what are the social impacts we see first is the reductions in transactions and there are other costs also which are being cut and the users may be you know they are internet savvy or they are just forced to use the internet because of these transactions because they are they are quite easy they save you time they save you money and the supply chain is shortened now there are no in between people customer service is good you just have to mail or, or just uh, send uh, a message and the other go person other people are going to respond then the productivity and efficiency has increased because the time and the effort resources are being greatly reduced and you can anyone not you only anyone can Uh, be an international market here or an international consumer these are some e business website which are very common wherever you uh, see the information and you transact the money and document these are all e business websites like irctc the lic the ebay the amazon the yatra the make my trips all these are e business websites e card this is simply a card or a greeting card but there is a difference this card e card is electronically produced that is it is created using digital media not actual paper or traditional materials and they are made by publishers usually on various internet site and you can send it to the recipient using uh, email very environmental friendly because you are not cutting any trees for the papers in traditional paper e cards you need paper you need other stuffs also they therefore they are environment friendly there is no carbon footprint and the card you don't have to use any card actually there is no 
product called paper or any extra material being used and you can just send it not to one but to any number of recipient as you require as you desire so this e card sender chooses some e on -on, some online catalog or e cards various publisher website they provide you with already made e card or you can make a e card there so after you select a card a sender can personalize it with its name to whom it's uh, being it's going to be sent and the messages photo and video can be added and then finally the sender will specify the recipient email address and the website will deliver an email message to the recipient on behalf of you the sender there are types of e cards flash anim animation these are type of e cards which are typically based on 2d vector animation which is controlled on the back side by some language scripting language this flash animation greeting cards they may have interactivity for example they can ask the viewer to choose a picture to animate animate right video e cards and this video it cards because uh, there are frames involved they use a combination of personalized text and video in order to send or convey the message to the recipient mobile e cards now we have mobile technology everything is on our smartphones we had mms multimedia services which are basic, uh, based on uh, basically picture sms and they are more popular nowadays we can send through whatsapp we can send through you know, we have facebooks whatsapps and, and there are so many uh, providers then we have web based multimedia e cards this web card a web based card creation now it has become more creative you as a user can create greeting cards online choosing the backgrounds there are variety of options there you can just drag and drop images animations smileys and you can also write text of your choice like your own handwriting e card games there are some e cards which include interactive games so what is the influence on the user the advantages of e commerce is the buying and selling has become easy faster and you can see view various products because in a shop there are limited products but online there are hundreds you can even buy or sell in the night that means 24/7 buying and selling is there because there is no geographical limitation nationally internationally more reach to customer is there the cost of operation is quite easy and the quality of service are very good and we no don't need to actual actually set up some company if you want you can do it but there is no need very easy to start the business and easy to manage all online all on the web now customer can easily select products that means if you want shoes you can just give the number and the color the company and you can just easily move around the way you are moving around in a mall or a departmental shop but there are certain disadvantages of e-commerce as well what are these anyone you are a good person but there may be bad people they can start a business and there are sites which can just eat your money the quality the product quality is not guaranteed nowadays like the big big uh, giants walmart amazon ebay they are giving quality product if you have any problem you can just uh, resend them or just return them in a week time or a fortnight time there are mechanical failures and in the total process they can uh, quite give some unpredictable effects because uh, there is no target customer to to client or to the seller interaction customer loyalty is always on a check 
and since there are so many computer savvy people who are who have malicious intent there are many hackers who look for the opportunities and especially where the transaction of money is going on transaction of service is going on there are payment gateways they are always prone to attack if you are doing e-commerce what things should you should keep in mind you are trying to do something uh, on internet or on web first is privacy right see it is e very easy to collect the personal information from a consumer using an e-commerce website then uh, security uh, by the way the online transactions are quite secure now they have some keys you know very very high high end uh, computer based key means software keys and digital keys so you anyone cannot enter they are they are they are having cryptographic content also so they these online in, transaction are inherently more secure in it's insecure sorry than those connected in person because there is no way to guarantee that a person making the payment is the actual owner of the credit card or some impersonator then price wars the people or the merchants who are selling at their shop they will find selling online extremely competitive because there are so many people for x they may be some one dollar and for the same x somebody may be charging five dollar so who will go to five dollar nobody everyone will come here but the product quality is uh, not being checked so there are price wars always returns and complaints selling online means usually a high return rate on products then when the purchase was conducted in person you can just go back and uh, you know return it to the merchant okay i don't like it this is the problem just take it give me give my money back so let us summarize what we have seen electronic data interchange is an electronic communication method that provides standards for exchanging data via electronic means edi it says or implies a sequence of messages between two parties p1 and p2 and uh, he or she or the organization can be originator or recipient anyone can be originator or recipient e-commerce any form of uh, exchange or transaction that is using electronic medium in order to uh, facilitate the transaction the e-cards are just like postcard or greeting card and the primary difference is they are not using the traditional paper or material they are just created on the digital media e-card businesses are considered very environment friendly because there is no carbon uh, print a uh, footprint and you are not cutting tree and they are very very cheap as compared to the are there some some cards are even you know you just have to pay for the internet for data otherwise everything is free flash animation this type of e card is based on 2d vector animation we have a scripting language that is controlling this flash animation video card combination of personalized text and video in order to convey uh, the heartful messages mobile e cards like mms is there web based multimedia e card this is also there e card games that may include interactive games so this is all about this chapter thank you so much and take care of yourself